gaff rig is a sailing rig in which the sail is four-cornered, fore and aft rig, controlled at its peak and, usually, its entire head by a spar called the gaff. Because the size and shape of the sail, a gaff rig will have running backstays rather than permanent backstays. The gaff enables a fore and aft sail to be four-sided, rather than triangular. A gaff rig typically carries 25% more sail than an equivalent Bermudian rig for a given hull design. A sail hoisted from a gaff is called a gaff rigged sail. Description Gaff rig remains the most popular fore-aft rig for schooner and barkentine mainsails and other coarse sails, and spanker sails on a square-rigged vessel are always gaff-rigged. On other rigs, particularly the sloop, catch and yawl, gaff-rigged sails were once common but have now been largely replaced by the Bermuda rig sail, which, in addition to being simpler than the gaff rig, usually allows vessels to sail closer to the direction from which the wind is blowing. The gaff is hoisted by two halyards. The throat halyard hoists the throat of the sail at the forward end of the gaff and bears the main weight of the sail and the tension of the luff. The peak halyard lifts aft end of the gaff and bears the leech tension. Small craft attach the peak halyard to the gaff with a wire span with eyes at both ends looped around the gaff and held in place with small wooden chocks. Larger craft have more than one span. Peak halyards pull upwards, approaching the gaff at right angles. Additionally, a gaff bang may be fitted. It is a line attached to the end of the gaff which prevents the gaff from sagging downwind. A triangular fore and aft sail called a jib-headed topsail may be carried between the gaff and the mast. Gunter rigged boats are similar, smaller vessels on which a spar popularly but incorrectly called the gaff is raised until it is nearly vertical, parallel to the mast and close adjacent to it. Top sails are never carried on gunter rigs. The sprit sail is another rig with a four-sided fore-aft sail. Unlike the gaff rig where the head hangs from a spar along its edge, this rig supports the leech of the sail by means of a spar named a sprit. The forward end of the sprit is attached to the mast but bisects the face of the sail, with the after end of the sprit attaching to the pecan, or the clue of the sail. Sailing Characteristics for a given sail area a gaff rig has a shorter mast than a Bermudian rig. In short-tended craft with full body, heavy displacement and moderate ballast ratio, it is difficult to set enough sail area in the Bermudian rig without a mast of excessive height and a center of effort too high for the limited stability of the hull. Because of its low aspect ratio, the gaff rig is less prone to stalling if oversheeted than something taller and narrower, reaching with gaff sails whilst reaching the sea being set further back will encourage a small craft to bear up into the wind, i.e., strong weather helm. The boat builder can compensate for this at design stage, e.g., by shifting the keel slightly aft or having two jibs to counter the effect. The gaff cutter is in fact a very popular sail player for small craft. The helmsman can reduce weather helm significantly, simply by sheeting out the mainsail. Sheeting out may appear to create an inefficient belly in the sail, but it is often a pragmatic alternative to having a heavy helm. A swing keel lifted halfway is the perfect treatment for weather helm on a gaffer. The usual adjustments to mast rake, or even bowsprit length may be made to a gaffer with persistent heavy weather helm. Running with gaff sails on a gaff-rigged vessel, any heading where the wind is within 20 degrees of dead aft is considered a run. When running with a gaff rig, the CE of the mainsail may actually be overboard of the hull. In a stiff wind the craft may want to broach. In light winds, or when racing, a water sail may also be set. Gallery, Gaff Rigged Schooner J, and D, Riggan. Her sails, from left to right, are, Jib, Staysail, Gaff Foresail, Gaff Mainsail, and, above that, a main gaff topsail. A near vertical gaff allows this gun to rigged boat to carry a triangular sail that is similar to the Bermuda rig. Gaffelar, by Johannes Christian Scotel, depicting both gaff and square rigged boats. Gaff-rigged yachts race on Sydney Harbour, circa 1900. Carmiter, racing cutter. Governor Ames, five-masted schooner. Victory Chimes, National Historic Landmark.
ZACA, owned by Errol Flynn, traditional Dutch sailing barge, the yacht of the VOC Chamber of Rotterdam, by Jacob van Strij, the schooner Rose Dorothea in 1907.